Hey, Mr. Cook, David Likens here. First our credit, wanted just to do a quick walk around video for you on the boat uh, you're looking at buying for you down there in Texas. Um, this is the 2019 Paddle King Low Pro Cruiser uh, with the newly designed pontoons they did last year in 18. Um, as you can see, um, navigational lights are standard. It is a padded cushion vinyl decking, three quarter inch marine grade plywood there. Uh, spare tire, powder coated trailer. Just walking around. This is the half gate that is an add on from Paddle King. As we go around the boat, there's your bimini, bimini top. It does have a boot, which I'll show you here in just a minute. Here is the rear access gate, allowing you to get in into the boat from here. It lifts up, has a safety stop there for you. The steering cable, throttle cable for your motor, aluminum transom mount, standard steering cable to the helm. Here is your bracket to protect the live wall pump off the stern of the boat. One wire is power, the other is for the, the water to feed up. I'm going to go up here uh, to the front of the boat. This is the hinge pin set. What it does is it goes from here and the set position pins into this location to lay flat, which will end up looking like that boat right there for lower storage. What we could do uh, based on our conversation, let me hop in the boat here real quick, is we would remove the corner seats for you on both sides. I put, I'd replace these and put in a cup holder that has a, a two rod holder position for you on each side, getting rid of this one. And you'd actually have this set here and then another set here on this side. So on the port side, you would have your live well and there's the boot cover. This is an adjustable flow knob and then your drain port, which goes straight out of the bottom of the boat. And then you've got this side here, storage with a bottom that keeps off the vinyl. So that way, if it does get wet, whatever you have in here won't be wet. And then here's just a quick shot of the helm. You've got your navigational lights and bilge pump for your live well under the rear seat is your storage to where you could put your fuel cell battery or batteries on that. And obviously uh, mounting a 20 horse on there, we'd have the fuel cell and you put your own battery in, but the motor uh, is and or would be broken and ready to go for you and set. So uh, if there's anything else you'd like to see, this is kind of a uh, standing at the bow looking back. Uh, there's your installed stainless steel ladder, nice tall height on the bimini. Uh, I'm right at six foot and that's actually above me a little bit. So that way if you wanted to have it up, you could, it is removable. Uh, we do put the pins in it so they're all removable. So that if you just didn't want the top on, that's not a big deal. You can just kind of pull it off and store it. So appreciate the phone call. Looking forward to working with you. And again, if there's some pictures or anything that you'd like to see above and beyond what I've done here, uh, just give me a call. I'm, I am gonna show you one more quick thing. Sorry about the jerkiness on the video. I'm gonna come around here and just kind of show you the, the shape of those pontoons a little better. Does have the channel cut there for rigidity and just drivability. Splash guard right in front of the motor mount there, as you can see. Pretty nice clean design. I think you and your friend will be really, really happy with it considering the boat only weighs 900 pounds and is roughly right at seven foot wide. 15 foot 2 inches long so uh, if there's anything else you need or have any questions again give us a call uh, I'll put my number and email down below for you uh, but I appreciate the opportunity to work with you